YouTube channel. Uh, as you can see right here, I'm just trying to get a firewall laid out for this car right here. That you'll you'll see here soon. I got all the bars and everything in it. But today I wanted to talk to y'all about setting up your spring back whenever you got to bend tubes. If you want to get the right numbers, you got to know how to do it. So follow me, and I'll show you. Hey, welcome back. I'm going to take a moment right here. I'm going to teach you a little bit of something about some spring back on this tube that we have to bend. What we're going to start with is whenever you get some material in for your cages or your chassis that you're building, a really important part is knowing how to calculate your spring back. All right, well, spring back is whenever you bend a tube, they want to always go back to their natural state. And all that changes with whatever material you're using, whether it's docal, chromoly, mild steel, it, it's all different. What you want to do is just cut you a scrap piece off, just load it up in your machine, just go ahead and bend it to a 45, take it out of the bender, go ahead and get you a, an angle finder and see what degree that is. So if you bend it to a 45 and you put your degree finder on there and it comes out 40 degrees. Well, just to keep it simple, we all know that 45 from 40 is 5 degrees. That's your spring back. Like I said, you started with a 45, it ended up being a 40 based on your angle finder. So that gives us the 5 degrees of spring back. So you want to account for that whenever you load your other material in and bend it. You always just want to go 5 degrees over or whatever your spring back ends up being. There you have it, just a short little video that I wanted to do to let y'all in on the tube bending that we do here. So you can apply this to your projects. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment if you'd like. You know, you can also shoot me a PM, an email, whatever. We'll get back to you. You know, let us know what you want to see. So until then, have a good day, and we'll see you again.